Is today the best day to put your home on the market? Find out why it's not. Hello everybody, I'm Brian Collins, Realtor and Your Listing Guru of California. So you want to know what's the best day to list your house? While there's no absolute guarantee, there are some pretty decent facts out there and some reoccurring trends that can direct us agents to help you, the seller. The general theory is that if you list your home too early in the week, on say a Sunday, your home's listing gets buried by the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and even the Thursday listings. So you're not on the top of the list when your potential and serious buyers are sorting through homes and creating their list to view either late in the week or over the weekend. Now there's really two different stats that a good agent will look at and plan when talking to you about listing your home. The first is, what day will net me the most money? So the article I read said historically Sundays were absolutely the worst day to list your home. So the researchers use Sunday as a baseline to just compare all of the other days. Um, so to achieve a higher price, homes listed on Wednesdays are typically shown to have a $2,023 advantage in sales price. There's not really any hard data to explain why this is, but the best guess of the researchers is that the agents who want to list on Wednesdays have the best grasp on pricing and strategy and that Wednesdays just may be the sweet spot for a balance between urgency and price. I always personally list on Wednesdays unless the sellers need a little bit more action than they need money. And then that brings up the next point. What day will sell my home the fastest? Like I said, listing your home on a Sunday is the absolute worst day to put your home on the market. The article concluded that if you're looking to sell your home faster and money is not the most important factor, then Thursdays are going to be the best day for you to list your home. Researchers found that homes listed on a Thursday sold typically five days faster than similar homes listed on different days. So that means your time on your market is going to be significantly reduced just by waiting to list your house one extra day. When you sellers care more about the time it takes to get your house off the market than a little extra to your bottom dollar, i list your house on Thursdays instead. So one reason for this may be that when homes are listed on Thursday, it's the last day before really serious buyers are putting together their list you know, to view the homes on Friday and Saturday. So if I wait to put your home on the market until Thursday, especially in the late afternoon or in the evening, then serious buyers just getting off work, they're gonna see your home listed the most recently. And when people see your home last, they're more likely to remember you, remember your home at least when it comes to making a purchase decision. So the one last thing I have to cover in this video is pricing. Just because you list your home on a Wednesday, that doesn't mean that there are magically going to be offers for your house that's 10 or $15,000 overpriced. So my job is to know the market and know my area. Trends change all the time and that's part of my job is to follow them. So realtors can give you the data to support the best market price for your home. If your home just doesn't have enough equity, yeah, so that's what equity is. If your home won't net you the money that you need to either move or purchase another house, then pricing the home over market value will cause your home to sit for a really long time until the market catches up to that valuation or someone comes along who's willing to pay it. There's this lovely image here that really demonstrates how pricing works in home sales. So when you price your home correctly, right in the middle, um, that's, the, at, that's at current market value, you can see your pool of potential buyers is about 60%. If you want to create a lot of movement, then you can price your home just under that market value, and that really opens up your buyer pool to 75% of available buyers. You can see that the higher you get over market, value, over market price, the potential of your pool of buyers goes down, and that's not good. That's not to say that you won't sell, but the amount of time that your home will sit will be much longer. And then the number of showings that you have will be substantially lower. Well, that's all I have right now. So if you want to know what your home's current market value is, you can check out value.listingguruca.com right now. Uh, it's on the screen here and it's a link is in the description below. Or you can simply text your name and your home address to 760-995-2835 and I will send your current market value right to you. If you found value in this video, then I would really appreciate a thumbs up, and if you want more tips and trips for selling your home, subscribe now and hit the button to be notified when I post new videos. I really appreciate you watching, and I really hope you have a superlative day. Bye-bye.